of last year, the twins, that they're the first set of twins, boy, girl, to come and first play in PSAO. Over 50 awards and trophies decorate their living room, but now handball high school champions and twins, Raquel and Joshua Garcia, can even compete. For me, it's really disappointing because I wanted to compete. Like My team was like a second family to me. I was angry and I wanted to know why, and there was many thoughts that were going through my head. The brother and sister duo got booted out of their handball matches because of a fine print rule. The public school athletic league regulations bar students who play interscholastic sports from competing for money or other compensation. They said that this, that this rule been out for over 20 years and I'm just hearing about it now. Joshua won $100 from a competition August. Raquel merely competed. If I knew about the ruling prior to this, I would have never ever joined this tournament if it jeopardized my tournaments from school. You can make amends, pay back that $100 and allow these two young people to play. Anthony D'Angelo, who's shooting a film on handball, has been following players like the Garcias. We should glorify students like this, glorify uh, kids that actually make an attempt to excel and not take away from them or not bring them down in ways of such trivial matters. There are many players that I know who have done exactly the same thing that I have done. Both believe it may have been a rival coach who ratted them out. That happened between them, whatever mistake, I think people deserve to get a second chance. And definitely the Garcia twins, they are very good kids. If someone didn't know that it wasn't through, they should have at least gave them a second chance. To the neighborhood, handball is more than a pastime, but a sport. To the Garcias, all they want is a second chance. This is Maria Sandoval for the New York Post. A good student, I don't understand why you would do something like this. Like, just let us play. It's our last year of high school.